Welcome back to Python interview tutorial. Here I will discuss important question which may ask you in interview process. The question is write a Python program to separate the number and a character from a given input. Consider a given list L1 which consists of combination of character and number values. We have to separate out character into another list and number into another list. So now here we will discuss how to solve this problem. Before I start, if you first time visit the channel, then do subscribe and press the notification bell icon so that you can get the latest updates on this interview preparation topic. Now we will see the discussion through the coding. First of all, we will understand the approach. In the given problem, list L1 is given which consists of combination of character and integer numbers. One by one, we have to iterate the every character of the input L1 and we have to separate it out numbers into one list and words into the another list. So here I will write the code for the same. So we will write a function, let's say separate out the data of the L1. We have to preserve the output into the number underscore list. Initially it is empty and word list which is again empty list where we can store the character kind of a data. We have to iterate every index using loop. So for i in a L1 it is get iterated. So if it is a number we will preserve into some variable. So number underscore data will hold the number information while the character kind of a data will hold the character inside it. So these are the two string variables which will hold the number data and the character data respectively. Now after that we will compare uh, every character which is in the list that may be number or that may be character or that may be symbol. So one by one that is going to be iterated. So for character in a given word or we can say element. So character in i. If that character, if the character is digit, if the character is digit, then we will preserve that character. Sorry, if the character is digit, then we will preserve that number into number data. So number underscore data is get updated with the previous value of the number data plus the element which is in the current index. If that character is not digit, it means that it is a character. So we can update that into the character variable character data is equal to character data plus ch. In this way, we can store one by one element which is inside the list. I will show you the execution afterwards. Then once it is get completed after the loop, we can append the number list. So number list is get appended with the numeric type of data while the character list or we can say word list not a character we write the word list is get appended with the character kind of a data. So this way we can enter it. After that for loop we are going to print a separate list number underscore list and another is word list. So when we execute this code, that time initial input is L1 which consists of this set of information. Let it be. In the first index element 1, 2, 3, hello 4 which consists of 5 characters in 4 numbers were there. And this is a particular element which is inside the list. So first of all, by using this first loop for i in L1, the first element is get picked. So 1, 2, 3, hello, 4 is get picked into the i. Then every character of that element is going to be iterated. So for example, this is 1, 2, 3, hello, 4. Now, one by one character is get iterated. So character in i. The first character is 1. So one by one, every character is going to be iterated inside the loop. So for ch in i, so that first element is get scanned and it will be compared. If it is a digit, will be stored into the number data. If it is not, then will be stored into the character data. The same process is going to be repeat for the next element that is 2. It is again number, will be stored into the number data. Then next is 3, it is again stored into the number data. 
then the first character h is come that time it is not a digit so if it is not a digit then it will be stored into the character data so likewise the element are going to be pick and finally we are going to append the two separate list one consist of all the numeric type of data other list consist of all the word type of data will execute the code so i just call the function separate data and input is l1 which is a original list once it is completed i'll execute the code can find a two separate outcome will get 12347888937123 hello world and set the same kind of a data is integrated in the original list l1 so if you uh, see the original list l1 consists of three elements out of which first element consists of 1 2 3 hello 4 which is get separated into 1 2 3 4 as a number list and hello as a word list while second one is 7 7 world 8 will be get separated out into the number list as a 7 7 8 while it is get separated into the word list as a world and so on so likewise you can put any input for this program you will get the output which is get separated character and the numbers separately into the list hope you understand the solution of this problem still if you have any doubt you can write it in the comment section i'll give more explanation of your doubt or if you know any another approach to solve this problem you can write it in the comment section thanks for watching this video